It's been nonstop. He has not had hardly any rest at all. Okay, so we'll modify the workout. He'll be all right. So where'd you learn how to do that? No, this this was taught to me by a a lady that worked for me. What you been doing? Sitting in the car? Yeah. What hasn't he been doing? <laughs> I used to love watching. I'm like, how is he knocking people out with the back pedal? How you thinking this fight gonna go with you, Tito? Knockout. Another knockout. Yeah. Yeah. All right, let's roll with Chuck Jack first. Oh, come on. Push, push, push. Pop, pop, pop. Hit it, hit it, hit it. Nice. I was looking around for someone to train with and where where my camp was gonna be. You know, Antonio was be honest, wasn't my first pick, wasn't my second pick. Um, I got talked into coming down and working with them. Um, and, and I'm, I'm really glad I did. I, 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 I love the way he works and what love what he's doing here. And uh, you know, he really gets involved. He really cares about it. And he, and he, and he pays attention. He's a great coach. Nice stuff, stuff, good. Yeah, good. Good. Yeah. Very one, two, three. Now he's moving faster and longer. Unbelievable. But I think a lot of it has to do with his diet. I don't know what he eating, but I'm definitely gonna find out when he get done because I'm the same age as him and I get tired and he keep going. I get back into fighting. You know, I realize I gotta do everything right. You know, from all the way from diet to you know, he's had sleep. No, no, I know. To, uh, uh, recovery. You know, you get, my body's been great to me. I recover from injuries and from training better than most people I know. But, you know, the older you get, it's more important recovery and training and training smart is. So, um, yeah, I think so great. Antonio gets it. Um, he's, he's getting me in great shape. I mean, I'm going to improve my speed um, and leaps and bounds from. Uh, week one of one of camp and, uh, and now and he's promising leaps and bounds from there so from here so I'm excited to see where I'm gonna be at. So no microwaves, huh? No microwaves. Yeah, it, you will not find any like pre-packaged diet meals that taste like these. Also, given um, other friends, like I've let them try my food and they didn't know that like it came out of a package and I cook it like this and they literally think it's like a gourmet meal. Like that I just prepared it and like, oh my gosh, your cooking is amazing. <laughs> Not necessarily um, would he be resisting it, but more so like just not paying attention, you know? Yeah. He wasn't educated on it. Now that he is, he, he, cho he chooses to do the same. And then for paleo, you know, I've heard so many good things about it, how it's an anti-inflammatory diet. And with everything he's doing, like, beating up his body, tearing his muscles, all the inflammation. Mm -hmm. That's why I think it's the best thing for him right now. And I would have I would have encouraged him to try like going without so much meat, but I just don't believe in like shocking your system right before a fight with something completely different than anything you've ever done. I make one in the morning, the one I have one made already to take with me to the gym. So I eat right after we practice. Just the way he lives his life has changed completely. And I was encouraging him to change up, you know, to just go with it and do something completely different. You know, maybe change up um, the area because where he used to train before is like, I don't know, 400 miles from where we live now. The hardest part is I, I miss my kids. Being away from the family, doing, doing camp down here, it's, 
it's good for me. I get, get the rest I need, the recovery I need, but I don't get to see my kids as much as I'd like to. He used to resist some things a while back, but now he's just like seen the differences and seen how he feels and seen, I mean, his body. He yeah. never had an eight pack. What it's happened? Weird. <laughs> yeah. Like, and he's able to come back and do what he's doing now. Like yeah, something. Like, it is good. Yeah. Really good. I was pleasantly surprised because I haven't had cat food. I definitely feel a different and see a difference in my body as far as um, recovery and training from the diet. You know, it's from me me being the, having that healthy approach year round has really allowed me to. Uh, make gains and improvements that I, I wasn't making in the past. I love fighting, and I didn't get to go out on my terms, I didn't get to finish on my terms. I wasn't ready to be done. I, I still felt that I had a lot left to give in the sport, and you know, this is my chance to, to show I still do. Yeah.